when you were arrested. I was were you terrified. <laughs> what, what I've actually never happened? been so afraid in my whole life. I hope I never am again. What actually happened? Did people with guns come to get you? Or? Uh, we were told to come downstairs in the hotel. And um, this was after days of, we tried to inquire to the ministry, you know, why would we be expelled? When would they wish us to leave? I was always willing to leave. I'm a pacifist. What can I do if they want me to go? So uh, they asked us to come downstairs, and we did. And they said it would just be two minutes. And then they took us in the locked room, and it's all over. And they showed me my own audio tape cassette that they had confiscated and I knew they had been spying on me all along, and they, in fact, had told us that the day before. The hotel manager, who isn't really managing that hotel, Kate, I mean, he's yeah. really I have told the Kate, committee. What instrument are of the government. Excuse me, what are your plans today, now? Yeah. Oh, wait, I'm sorry. Me. Ayatollah Khomeini said today that he plans to ask the Ministry of Labor in Iran to give equal rights to women. Good. You think yeah. that's because of your trip, or? that situation of the entire tyrannical power of the state against the individual. And this is what the women in Iran are up against now. They are, uh, they are afraid of being arrested. And when they're detained, it isn't going to be, please take an airplane and get out of here. They maybe won't be able to get out. All these women worked against the Shah, too, a lot of them abroad. They're used to, in fact, oh, being persecuted. but. At, you know, after the insurrection, when people in Iran finally thought they had democracy and were making a beginning at it, because the thing is awfully complicated, as I'm sure you're aware, um, to see those democratic rights eroded, you know, and to see uh, to see everything that you that you struggled so hard for, those people went out into the streets against the tanks. I don't know of any situation in modern or ancient history where against a tyrant the people have risen as one at enormous risk of their life. People were shot and they came back the next day. Um, every time that people have tried to rise like this in our time they were put down or they haven't been able to. of the most brutal and stupid remnants. 